Hey, what's up, amigo? This is Joe Perez, host of Amazon Mambo. Whether your project is inside the house, out in the lawn, or you're going on vacation, I'm going to help you tackle those projects. Plus, give you tips from time to time while you're on vacation. Do you remember the last two video recordings that I posted? One is in Spanish, one is in English. If you haven't seen that, I'm going to put the link right here, okay? Go to it, and I'm going to show you in that video how to uh, make these quick buckets. I have researched YouTube and I have not found a demonstration of how this works. With reason, I attempted the first time to do it and just like the Energizer Bunny, it goes and goes and goes, I went ahead and poured liquid okay, in the tube and I put liquid and I put liquid and I put liquid and it continued to put in liquid until I, uh, what's going on here? There's way too much liquid and I don't see the containers okay, getting filled up. So I stopped, I looked at it, and I pushed down on one of my gowns and another one popped up. And I pushed on that one and another one popped up. They're like, oh my goodness gracious, now I know why nobody has demonstrated. And it's because since it's light, the water went underneath and it was pushing all the containers, all the bottles, and also the dirt. So what I've done, it's a little change, and I'm gonna demonstrate second time how to do this. Like I always say, vamos al mambo, ting 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 ting. Amigos, I'm going to give you a quick explanation once again of how this works. We're going to go ahead and put the liquid through here. The liquid is going to go to the first gallon. It's going to come out of the little holes on the bottom and it's going to spread. It's going to make that dirt moist. So once it gets moist all around, the liquid is going to go into every single one of the gallons and the bottles uh, created under the reservoir. We have a little hole over here, okay, and that is going to tell us when we have reached um, the bottom and everything uh, filled with uh, water for these plants. The roots are going to go down into the humid section or the wet section, okay, leaving this section right here, uh, which is going to be dry, and they're going to go ahead and have oxygen going on to the roots. If we wouldn't do that, then basically they will die, they will drown. In theory, um, every single one of these containers should be filled up with water so let's go see if this uh, works this time uh, by the way uh, the first time everything popped up this time what i've done is i put hot glue underneath every gallon uh, around um, all the plastic bottles and i put uh, these two uh, cords uh, from trimmer in the hopes that keeps everything down let's see if it works Amigos, did you get all that? What I'm saying is that I can see the water going through the dirt onto each of the gallons. As I pointed out, all the gallons right now are, are getting filled with water. All right, let me see if I can give you a close up. There's the water. This water is going to continue inside these reservoir and it's going to go down as the water uh, comes out of the bottom hole because of the dryness and because of the plant is going to be hydrated. In a week or two, just stick a stick through the pipe and measure the water level. That way you'll know how much water you have to go ahead and input once again. See that? All 
price so my glue did hold up as you can see I demonstrated how this works uh, they are filling up this one here it just passed about halfway uh, so the way that uh, we are going to be doing this because the this area right here gets wet quickly what I do is I pour the water once it starts coming out then I move on to one of my other buckets and I let it rest and then I will come back and continue to fill up this way it will take me about uh, once a week or even uh, once every two weeks to fill this up um, depending on the heat of course of summer what kind of plants you have in here such as lettuce or tomatoes you know they do drink a lot of water you might have to pour the water into here you know a little more often however you won't have to do it to do it daily like we do with the other uh, plants and other methods this way they would uh, uh, drink the water on their own, take the gas out of it, and also avoid the fungus that's created when you uh, pour the water over on top. Don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to hit like and hit that uh, bell so you'll be notified. Hope you like the video, until next time.